All right, so after our great raptor migration was turned into an okayish raptor migration by the solar eclipse and some storms, we decided we'll add another birding trip to the birding trip and we're now in Caño Negro. Caño Negro is a wetland and an important stopover for migrating birds, but it's also the home of the habiru stork. Who knows, maybe we'll find one today. Buenas, hello and welcome back to Habiru Stories, your channel for everything even remotely related to birds. We reached out to local birder and guide Chambito, who was unfortunately busy the next morning, but set us up with a room at his sister's lovely cabinas and a boat trip with his friend Jimmy. It's really a quaint little town in what feels like another world. Some 20 kilometers from the road to Los Chiles, it's the mix of the place's remoteness and the incredible heat and humidity that really makes you wonder how people sustained their lives here in the days before ecotourism. Fishing, farming and cacao, Jimmy tells us. The people here are tough. And Jimmy and the boat trip were incredible. The high water level in the rainy season made some parts of Laguna accessible that remain hidden in the dry season. What a spectacular place. And the birding? We'll let the pictures speak for themselves. All right, time to head back. This was really cool, but it's time to continue our search for the habiru. Sometimes you can see them in the fields from the road. Let's see. One of the nice things about this place is that it's a very special habitat and you'll find many species here that you'll find nowhere else in the country. Most people only visit in dry season, but the habitat is actually drastically different in wet season. Water levels are higher, which gives access to some birds, while others have more space to hide. So it's really a trade-off, so you should visit in both seasons. And just like that, a good day of birding turned into a great day of birding. We didn't find any habiru in Caño Negro, so we decided to drive up the road a little bit to a wetland called Medio Queso. And Mari spotted three habirus um, in the wetlands, absolutely beautiful. They gave us a welcome, put on a show, really amazing. And a cool place too.
Thanks for watching this week's video. We'll be back next Friday with a new one. In the meantime, leave a comment to let us know your feedback, your wishes, your dreams, or your deepest fears. Or check out our store at Habiru Clothing. That's habiru-clothing.com. Our designers, well, that's me, have worked tirelessly to come up with some cool shirts for every sort of bird lover. Maybe your new favorite shirt is just a hop away. Have a look. Happy weekend. And see you soon. Ciao.